guys, what's up? I'm doing my makeup right now. Um, I haven't even started, but my skin's going through it. Um, I've started to use new cleansers and my skin, I don't think is liking them, honestly. They're like natural, um, I don't wanna say like, I don't know. Honestly, I got them in can, which I totally forgot to tell you guys. Sorry, I'm literally wearing a pajama top and I'm, my armpits might not be shaved. I'm like completely just say whatever. Why do we even do this? I didn't show you the cleansers that I got in Canton, but they were like natural and whatever. Don't worry about the color of my skin right now. Don't worry. I'll, I'll fix it, okay? They're like the more like natural cleansers, which I was super duper excited about. Sorry if that music's too loud. I might need to turn that off in there, but... I just needed some background noise because it was super quiet. So in Canton, whenever we saw this natural cleanser, I was like, oh my gosh, it has Manuka honey and like natural like antibiotics and all these benefits. So I was like, oh my gosh, I definitely should try that. And now I'm like, is it making my skin worse or is it like clearing it? I don't really know what it's doing, but I feel like my bacteria is almost back and I know I don't know if it, that's it or it's just like helping cleanse my skin and everything is coming out. It just feels like itchy like that bacteria did. So that kind of stinks, but I'm like, maybe it's just working and yeah, I don't know. I thought I'd just come on here because I have not like done a kind of get ready with me in a long time. But since we've got stuff going on this weekend, I was just like, why don't I go ahead and vlog? Also, if I sound like nasally, I don't know, but I woke up, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what happened, but I woke up with a really, like, you know how, like, kids cough and they sound really bad and you're like, whoa, you sound really bad? I don't know if I'm the only one that does that. Like, it's my nieces and nephews and I'm like, ooh, you sound terrible. But that's how I was this morning. I was like, oh my gosh, I sound like, I seriously am so sick. But I don't feel bad. I just cough like I'm dying. <laughs> I've been doing pretty good about vlogging and editing and stuff, so that's super exciting. I'm super glad that I feel like motivated to do it because usually I used to be like, well, you know, I'll edit it whenever I'm at work and once I get to work, I'm like, mm, no, I don't really want to. So I know I look really good now. My hand is so white. Look at my arms. It honestly looks like I'm wearing gloves because my arms tan and my hand's white. What's tomorrow? We actually are not doing our pictures. I told you guys about me and Emma doing pictures together this weekend, which actually didn't end up working out. It's supposed to be like really cold. It's cold and rainy today, but it's supposed to be cold and rainy tomorrow, I guess. There's also a chance of snow. So I actually would love to do pictures in the snow. Like that's like a dream of mine to do like a photo shoot in the snow. I'm actually working tomorrow, which it's Saturday tomorrow. I usually don't work Saturdays, but nobody else could work and I was kind of like the one to be like I'll work if you guys don't want to because I obviously love working and taking everyone's hours is something I love to do I'm just kidding I just love to work and um the girl was busy that usually works Saturdays so I'm filling in for her then I'm going to like a fitness thing with Emma and Kelsey which I do not work out I don't do anything fitness wise and they invited me like last minute actually Emma invited me as soon as she heard about it actually I don't know if she invited me or I said oh I'll go with you guys like that might be fun I don't know if I invited myself or not but <laughs> um, yesterday Kelsey said something about it about going and so we're all gonna go to dinner probably and then go to it I'm scared people are gonna be like oh what workouts do you do or like something like that people ask me that all the time like what do you do work out or you know if I've I don't know, and it's super awkward because I'm always like, boy, if you think I work out, you're crazy. I don't know, be pressured into buying anything or them say like, well, you should start by these workouts, and then I'll be like, okay, whatever. I usually am pretty good about turning people down. <laughs> Not turning them down, but just like, being like, oh no, no thanks, I'm good. I guess I should probably say that. I've been trying to work out. Like whenever I'm at work and it's not busy, I'll try to do like squats and um, lunges and I'll do some ab workouts. Like you can literally do whatever. <laughs> you can do anything in there. So I've just been trying to work out because I'm like, I have time to kill. And if I'm not like 
working, I'm usually eating. I'm like so focused on my eyebrows that I'm not really paying attention to what I'm saying. I wonder if people hate my eyebrows. Sometimes I wonder that like when I'm doing them, I'm like, do people hate my eyebrows? Just tell me, it's okay if you do. I really don't care. <laughs> so I was actually gonna like hurry and get ready and go to the bank, but since I'm on here talking so much, I don't think I'm gonna even have time. Let's go dive bloodlines playing in the background right now. I hope I don't get copyright flagged um, because I do pretty much in every one of my videos. <laughs> what can you do about it, I guess? Muscadine Bloodline is playing. They are so, so good. I wish they'd come to Oklahoma because <sighs> I just think they're really, really great singers. So if you haven't heard any of their stuff, go listen to it. What are you doing? My favorite song of theirs is for sure. I literally forgot the name. I'm such a huge fan. <laughs> I'm like listening to this song right now, so I can't think of the name. Oh, it's called Mind of Its Own. Okay, yeah, I just remembered. Alright, so basically I guess I could go ahead and just tell you like what products I'm using and stuff. Um, I used NARS Radiant Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. That's such a long name. I've been using it for quite a while now, and it seriously is like my favorite foundation. Then I used Tarte Shape Tape of and then my Anastasia Brow Wiz. Now I'm using my, um, I think it's Makeup Revolution. Yeah, Makeup Revolution Luxury Baking Powder and Banana. I use this to set my whole face because personally my skin is so oily and I can get away with that. I feel like it might be drying or too much for dry skin. I just like to brush all the excess off. You guys remember my makeup tutorial? Please don't look at it if you're like thinking about it now that I said it. My first makeup tutorial, my only makeup tutorial I think, I said access instead of excess, which was really, really embarrassing. Well, people like ask me if I have a makeup tutorial and I always say no, even though I do have one on here, I say no because that was just horrible. Like, I don't even want to go back and watch it. I haven't gone back and watched it. So, I know it's bad. Like, I know it's not good. And then I'm using the um, Becca Bronzer. And this is the color Bronze Bondi. I love this. People, like, ask me what kind of bronzer I use. And I always tell Becca, and they're like, really? Like, kind of surprised. But I actually really like it. And it actually has some sparkle in it, um, which is kind of crazy because I used to like be so against like sparkly bronzers and stuff but it's very unnoticeable so I honestly really recommend that one. Whatever's left on this brush which this is a Morphe brush my favorite blending brush um to use and there's always like I always use brown I always use brown with this brush so if there's ever anything left on it I just put it on just to help me look a little bit like I tried I guess. Oh, I love this song. It's not actually Brow Gel. It's actually Great Lash by Maybelline, and it's the clear one. And I've always used this in my brows. The Anastasia Brow Gel really didn't live up to the hype. So now I use this, and it honestly, I think, works a little bit better. I'm not going to like you guys. And it's way, 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 way cheaper. Sometimes whenever I'm doing my makeup, I forget how to do my makeup. Is that weird? Yeah, probably. Okay, so I'm actually using the Jaclyn Hill palette, and it's the first, the top row. It's definitely a highlight shade. And my pop always asks me why it looks like I wiped off my makeup above my lip. Because I do this right here. He's like, why do you have glitter above your lip? I'm like, so my lips look more voluptuous. And he always is like, Josie, what the heck does that even mean? <laughs> he always, like, he always, always says something about it, so... This is for you, Papa Joe. I have my lash extensions on. I just got them done on Monday, I believe. Yeah, Monday. And uh, I don't know if I want to keep getting them done. I love my lash lady. Seriously, my favorite person ever. I love talking to her. She's such a great person. Like, seriously, my best friend. <laughs> they look great, but I'm so rough with them. And she's having her baby, so I'm supposed to go to someone else anyway. And so all together, it's just like, is it really worth it? 
to go to someone else and there's no really openings for the other girls right now. I checked online. <sighs> you guys feel my pain. Huda Beauty. Um, liquid matte lipstick. This is in Bombshell. It's so, so pretty. I'll put it on. I'll put it on just to show you guys. I'll probably leave it on all day, but still. Like, look how pretty that is. Mm, mm, mm. I can do my makeup in like five minutes if I really wanted to, but since I was chit chatting, I'm done here. I'm gonna go actually fix my hair. Or I have work tomorrow morning. I'm gonna go ahead and curl it. That way I don't have to do anything when I wake up tomorrow and I can set my alarm later. It's a smart thing to do. See you later. So I'm at work now. I went to the bank earlier. That's it. I ordered some jeans last night from a boutique I've ordered from before and they're super quick on delivering it. I think they're out of Texas, but super, super great boutique. Everything, they post like every single day, all the time, like on top of things. So I ordered some jeans from there, which I'm scared are gonna be too big because they came in like small, medium, and large. And I think the small was like, I usually wear like a double zero in American Eagle and if places don't have double zero then I just get zeros but these like ran from two to four I think in the small so hopefully I have been doing squats I have gained a little bit of weight in my booty area so oh, I hate saying that and that's the small size they had like I had to go with it anyway but maybe they'll look good everyone's like they're gonna swallow you they're gonna be too big but we're gonna see and I'll let you guys know about them. They're super duper cute. So I'm gonna edit some of this vlog and then just end it today and then I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. I'll see you guys tomorrow. It's Saturday morning. I'm vlogging while driving. My dad's behind me so he's definitely gonna say something about it. <laughs> We're headed to breakfast right now. Yeah, so super excited about that. Um, also, Dad started my truck this morning, which was super duper sweet. I'll talk to you guys later. So, I just left breakfast. I didn't even vlog whenever I was there. This guy was totally gonna go in front of me. You know what? You're so freaking rude. <laughs> breakfast was really, really good. Um, I'm just heading to work now. So, I'm at work. Um, I actually just did a little sign, because we have this little sign that we put, like, sayings on and stuff, and the owner came in here. Um, Tiff if you're watching because she told me she watched one of my videos <laughs> But Tiff if you're watching love you <laughs> So she came in here like probably a week ago and said something about the sign because it said something about Christmas And she's like we need to change that like if you think of anything, you know, you can change it and she tells me that all the time um, And I changed it before Halloween and I think in the middle of the summer I did And like every now and then I'll just put something on there because usually they'll just put on like sales or buy one get one half off like stuff like that and I just put just funny things like just whatever I want <laughs> so usually I'll just put it on there and I'll text one of them and I'll be like what do you think and usually they like it so they'll keep it up for a while <laughs> I couldn't think of anything to put so I was like every day I'd come in here and I'm like should I change it and I'm like I can't really think of anything but then today it hit me what to say because I think this is funny and I'm like trying to think of stuff that rhymes with like tanning tan you know sun like whatever and so today it hit me and I knew what to put so I'll show you guys what I did okay so <laughs> I know so many people are gonna be like what the heck it says girls you don't need a man you need a tan and it ha it's hashtag girls just want to have sun <laughs> so that's what I put on the sign and I just I sent her the part where it just says girls you don't need a tan you need a or you don't need a man, you need a tan. Oh shoot, I messed up. So I just sent her that part and then I added on the hashtag, girls just wanna have sun, which was so hard getting all those little tiny letters with my nails and putting them in there. I've been working on this for at least 45 minutes. Just those few words, so it helps the day go by pretty quick. We were super duper busy earlier though, which was fantastic. Oh, I'm about to eat my lunch. I'm ready for three o'clock because I guess once I get off work, I'm gonna head home and maybe change or something. And I might stay in the same clothes, I don't know. And then we're gonna leave for that fitness convention or whatever, and I think it's downtown. So, do I really wanna go downtown? No, downtown actually is not the place for me. I'm such, 
I'm not a downtown person. Well, I guess downtown Tulsa anyway. So I'm a little nervous about that, but we're gonna see, we're gonna see. I'm